was a conference where clinicians and scientists could meet and share some of their work, and we're often in completely different worlds. So Tejal showed her work with these beautiful, flexible, tiny films that her, I saw were perfect for the eye, and she was uh, showing some of her results where she had been working either with bone regeneration or with uh, chemotherapy or diabetes where her devices were able to deliver not just simple molecules but also complex molecules like uh, antibodies and that was really music to my ears because one of the major drug classes that we use in retinal therapy are these antibody based drugs which are very delicate very difficult to handle uh, molecules and Tejal had already successfully solved that problem. When I met Bob and he described why patients were getting needles into their eye monthly, um, I said, here, you know, we're developing some technologies that potentially could be useful. We started bouncing off ideas and we came up with some prototypes that eventually led to creating an implantable thin film device, which we're using to treat these patients. I think that Tejal and her group uh, can do some fantastic things that they almost take for granted or they think are mundane and I can see you know the delivery of an antibody with perfectly level uh, perfectly level concentrations for months at a time to them that's something that's sort of run-of-the-mill and I can immediately see you know how that could change the world in ophthalmology and so um, you know we can sort of sit in a room and just brainstorm ideas um, and many things we think are obvious uh, but we've never thought about actually applying them to an important problem. So it's just been a really fun, um, enthusiastic collaboration.